Alright, hey guys, it's NST Never Stop Traveling, and today I'm doing a review on My Place Hostel. So, if you guys are staying in Okinawa, Japan, and you want to check out My Place Hostel, I would definitely check it out. If you need a good place to stay and you want to be by, um, you want to have a good view, you want a place that's not too loud, you want a good place to do some work, maybe meet some people, this is definitely the place to go. Um, it's nice because they have a good little lounge area, they have a good, cool little table. That lounge area is actually open 24-7, which is really convenient. You can sit in there and do some work, you know, do some emails, maybe check out your next place to go travel or visit. Maybe you want to go check out Aishima, the biggest, second biggest aquarium in the world, up in Nago, or maybe you want to see the tunnels of Okinawa, Japan, or you know, whatever it is you want to explore and go see. This is a good place to go do it. They have free Wi-Fi, which is really good. Um, and at this hostel, the rooms are comfortable. They have AC rooms and non-AC rooms. The shared dorm rooms, uh, I didn't get too much footage of those, but they're basically like um, like different compartments and whatnot. I'll put the pictures up on the screen for that. They have the private room. Um, you can share with another person, but it's you know a smaller room with just one bed. They also have the double suite, which has a private bathroom. Um, that's a good double bed room and whatnot. Um, they have extra bathrooms and extra showers. If you don't, you know, if someone in your room is taking a shower, you can just jump up to, I think, the third floor, there's extra showers. And also in the lounge area, there's a couple of extra showers and bathrooms. Um, but yeah, overall, this is a good place to go if you're looking for a um, place that's in a good location. It's not too far from, I want to say, National Street. I went there yesterday to get some uh, charging cords and stuff. And at uh, National Street or Kokosai Street, it's only about, I want to say it took me 20 minutes to walk there. And in Kokosai Street, super cool. I should definitely do a video reviewing that place. Hopefully I, I do make one. If I do, it's in the description box below. And um, that place is really kind of touristy, but a good place to get some drinks or walk around or explore. Here's some cool traditional Japanese uh, Okinawan music. The Okinawan culture is a little bit different from mainland Japan. Here, they're a lot more chill and laid back. And um, so definitely, definitely some really good people here, really good food. Um, it is a little bit more expensive than maybe like um, the Philippines or uh, Thailand or Indonesia. But if you're looking for a safe, comfortable place to go, um, my place is a great hostel to do that. Okinawa, Japan is a great country or a great, uh, uh, well, it's part of the Ruku Islands. I believe it's a Providence, which is definitely a good place to check out if you're in Japan. Um, if you live in Japan, of Japan, one of the beautiful places you can go to is Okinawa, Japan. Um, so I'm getting a little off topic here, but I just wanted to show you guys this hostel and hopefully this video helps you guys out. If, um, if you're looking to, for hostels to check out in Okinawa, Japan, um, definitely book them on hostelworld.com. I'm not sponsored by this hostel or, or Hostel World, but I definitely recommend um, this place and Hostel World. But um, yeah, if you guys have any other videos you want me to make or if you have any questions or concerns about this place, um, yeah, definitely let me know. Put it in the comment box below. Um, put it in the comment box below. Make sure I get that like. And if you want to see more videos about different hostels around the world and places to check out, or you want to see you know, the cool sights and stuff to see in different islands and countries, um, yeah, definitely, definitely subscribe. And uh, um, peace out, guys. NST.